But for 2 chains, it's still Michael Jordan. So he's heading over to AA Mint to see just how much people will pay for a trading card with the goat on it. Oh, here we go. There she go. Who is it? There she go. Don't play with me. Look how they look it. I've never seen this card before. I know it. In 2020 alone, eBay's trading card sales shot up 142%, raking in over $2 billion. Why? Because everybody wants a piece of the GOAT greatness immortalized in shiny cardboard, 2 Chain's search for the most expensivest piece of that GOAT magic brings him to AA Mint, where a father GOAT and a baby GOAT make their dough collecting and selling trading cards. What? You're going to do the, uh, what am I, the wall mark reader? <laughs> no, you're going to do the wall presentation. Huh? You're going to do the wall. How you doing, Mr. Chains? <laughs> it's no this is no different than any, any other customer. We ready, gang? Coming in hot. We should have met him before we started. <gasps> oh. Knock, knock, knock. What's up? How y'all doing, man? Hey, good. All right, good to see you, man. Welcome to the store. I'm Mark. I'm Two Chain. What's up, Two Chain? Nice, nice to meet, meet you, Mark. How you doing, Aaron? This is Aaron, my nice son. Nice to meet you, man. For sure, man. Little family-run business. Man, listen. Man, you got to tell me more about what you got going on, the space that you have, how long you've had this space, how did it become a family business? OK. Why are you resilient? Well, I How do you source these? How do you know it's a good deal? to buy and know that you can get money, you know, in the long run. You know what I mean? It's, it's a lot and of... And tell me what it was like during the pandemic. It was something that it... I mean, how did you become an expert in, in what we got going on here? Yeah, like, 78, when I was a kid, we were collecting baseball, and, like, 78 to 85, I was really active in it. Wow. And then, like everybody else, you kind of grow up and get a real job. All right. You know? And, and during the pandemic, uh, Aaron and I were... We were, went to our safety deposit box, stumbled on a Wayne Gretzky rookie card. which is one of the best hockey players of all time. Right, of course. I paid like $25 for that when I was a kid. Uh, we sent that card out to PSA to get it graded, and it came PSA, back. PSA, what's that? PSA is a company that grades cards. How do they out. rank the, what, what does it go Yeah, to? it goes to 10. Since it was such an old card, seven and a half, so it was still worth a decent amount of money. So we ended up selling it for about $2,500 on eBay. Okay. And we're like, all right, we're going to go buy the goats. We're going to go buy Jordan. We're going to buy Kobe. We're going to buy Shaq. We're going to buy Brady. Oh, right? so that, is that how you, because I don't even know how you source them. We kind of learned along the way. When it, the card's not graded, it's called a uh, raw card. Raw so raw it's, card. let's say it goes for $30. But if it grades a PSA 9, which is mint condition, they call it, it's worth $90. So there's that arbitrage in, in between. And back then, the grading was about $8.50 a card. So you can see where you can make that money. Mm -hmm. And if the corners are right, if the centering's good, you know, there's all these little minute details. Amazing. This is our Jordan grid, okay? Jordan grid is. It's a Jordan grid. grid. He, That's he's, hard. he's the goat. He gets his own grid. That's hard. <laughs> pick one you pick one you like. All right, let me show you, man. I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you I know how I know what I'm doing. Okay. Give me one second. <laughs> uh, let me see. I'm gonna go. 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 I'm going with this card. I'm going right. with this card. That card is a replica that Fleer made. It, 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 it's a replica of the original rookie card, which in that grade would be worth two hundred thousand dollars. So I'm um, see what see what I'm saying. Yeah. Like, so what's the 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 most expensive Michael Jordan card that you have up here? It's gonna be this guy right here. This gold card. The gold card. The gold. Card. That's that that goes by rarity, and there's not a whole heck of a lot of them. We go here, click on that you'll see the pricing of every card comes in underneath. And then what we do is we take the suction, we bring it over here, we give it to Aaron. Aaron rings it up. So here's your card. 
Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Educate me on the Pokemon craze. The condition is so much more sensitive because okay. they're meant to be used. OK, gotcha. Right now, the grading companies are getting hit with more Pokemon cards than they are with all the sports no, cards I, combined. I, I know. This is a 2000 first edition Dark Charizard. The hollow is perfect. That card's worth a, a, about four to five thousand dollars right wow. now, and That's they go into mean. the millions. This Lost Origin comes out on Friday. We're gonna get twenty-five cases. Get here. You're gonna be the first one to open a pack. Oh, here we go. There she go. So there there she go. There she go. Don't play with me. Look how they lick it. Eternity. Look how they lick it. Eternity. Look how they lick it. Eternatus. Eternatus. That means something. I've never seen this card I before. I know it. Get him now! <laughs> I hit my leg. That's, watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Let's look, let's call PSA right now, <laughs> and let's see. <laughs> no, I can do anything with my with my mind too. I can do anything. Oh! <laughs> now, Ooh. I don't think this one's out yet. It I'm, ain't even. I'm telling you, somebody's selling this exact card. For thirteen dollars. Thirteen thousand. <laughs> Cut. I think the most valuable part of this card is that you pulled it. Oh. Every card collector is a treasure hunter, and the greatest adventure for a card collecting treasure hunter is doing a break. It's when a collector buys an entire box of card packs to try to find that one goat card in the series. That's what we're looking for. A two hundred dollar box might just yield a twenty thousand dollar gem. I heard somebody's from Atlanta, and they like yeah, Trey Young. Yeah, man, yes, bro. All right, here's what we got. Basketball wise, we got some basketball stuff. Basketball wives? No, not basketball wives. Oh, I'm about to say they got cards. So look, this is 2018-19. Then we also got Zion and John Morant rookie okay. year, and then uh, last year's, which is gonna be Lamelo and Ant Man. Go at it, guys. <laughs> Can I join you on ripping this? Oh yeah, it'd be easy and quick. I got her. Jeff Green, Frank. Ten. You got more? Rip, rip. You guys keep on ripping. Mm, I'll All keep right, up. Right, I'm do that right now. Got gotcha. you. We haven't hit the autograph yet. So. Right, <laughs> looking for. We're looking for. We're looking for Lamelo, and we're looking what, for. What Ant about the James Harden? That ain't nothing. Nah. Terrence Mann, Clay Thompson. I got the Jordan Poole right there. Oh! oh. Don't play with right me. Jordan Poole rookie. Got the Jordan Poole. What's up, fam? Yo! I'm going crazy. This is actually fun. Those are the money cards. You see, see how they feel different than the other ones? Out of 85. 85 in the world. Oh, that. This is a nice one. It's a, it's a refractor, too. You can see it. All right, now we're pulling some heat. Um, right. Ben Simmons. So you did not just get a Ben Simmons. Oh. Trey Young. Oh, there you go. Trey Rookie. Oh, yeah. I told you. There we go. And each pack you open essentially makes the, the sealed boxes and the sealed product more valuable. <laughs> Burr, that's hard. Oh, oh, what is oh, that? Oh, 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 I want to look that up. Right, Where'd he go? Here we go. We got to see how much that's worth. Be gentle. Look at the um, price on that. It looks just like it. Are you serious? <laughs> it says my card is worth 25 grand. Man, thank you, man. That's Multiple so, Barclays. That's so thank cool, you. It's fun. Is this yeah. joke is worth 25 grand? This would be one of the best episodes I've ever shot. And then we got some very expensive cards to show you. We got some big time cards to show you. Who's your favorite player? My favorite player. It's probably it's LeBron, man. Oh boy. But over, over time, you know, it was Kobe. Then, you know, Jordan. So who's better, LeBron or Kobe? I, I'm not allowed. I'm, I can't have that conversation. So how about we start off with Kobe Bryant? That's a gold card. This is a gold Kobe. It's a nine, it's nine out of 10 condition. Correct. It's a 98 version. Mm -hmm. This is 42 out of 81. This card, anywhere between 15 and 20 grand. Bam, exactly. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Yeah. 
the first out of 99 with the jersey. <laughs> You're dead on again. For real. You are dead on again. Y'all looking at each other at the same time. No, I'm, well, I'm, 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 trying to, I'm trying to figure out where you got these numbers from because you're dead on. That's that's right around fifty thousand dollars. Yes. I used to sell things and before I got here. All right, here we go. Oh, we got a LeBron. It's my main man. It's number two out of four. So did, did you spend about? Got a LeBron two out of four. I'm thinking you probably paid around 34 or something like that. Gage, how much less than this? So you paid 17,000 for it. You bought this in July from somebody that didn't know what the hell they had. Apparently, if you did not pay, you paid 10,000 for this card, bro. But this card is worth well over six figures. Hey, what, what did you pay? 7,500. And what did you pay for it? Two thousand. I'm I'm just tripping on how much times, you know, you multiplied your money from this. This is a real hustle. Yeah, for real. This is National Treasures. National Treasures is like top of the line Johnny Walker Blue. This is card number nine of ten. The owner doesn't want to grade this card because every day he takes the card out and he smells that pigskin. That's real pigskin. Smell that, baby. Isn't that good? So that's why I won't grade this card, because this is my favorite card. Isn't that good? Oh, man. This is a monster. Babe Ruth? I don't even believe that's real. That is real. I don't believe this is real. It's authenticated and certified. I don't believe this is real, yo. A babe might be worth about a half a million or 250. Between 150 and two. We got some big time cards to show you. Who's your favorite player? My favorite player is probably is LeBron, man. Oh boy, I got something crazy for you. I got keep two bucks. Wow. All right, so this one, only 250 in the world. Wow. This is from 03, I can tell. It's from 03. It's 10 out of 10. There's only nine in that condition. That card is worth about a third of a million dollars right now. Mm. Okay? And he paid $900 for that card. Wow, man. This is about being the GOAT, being a GOAT in your field. And I must say, I think I met a GOAT and the baby GOAT. Appreciate y'all, um, my stuff. I need yes. stuff. Thank you, guys, man. See you Thank soon. You. Thank you so much. Thank you, man. Appreciate your time. <laughs> yes, sir.